Hello, today I'm going to show you how to use the Carlisle coat. This is the Whip It Away Mac. And this is the one that has the hole for the harness. So we're going to slip it over Winnie's head like that with the help of a bit of venison sausage. Winnie, 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 what's this? <laughs> Oh yes, this could all go horribly wrong. That's it. Good girl. Winnie, come. Come here. Winnie, come. Good girl. So, we need to face the camera, Winnie. So when you've got it over the dog's head, you can just secure it with the elastic and the toggle. And underneath this flap, you should be able to find your D-ring. That's on your, on your harness. And there you go. You've got the dog on a harness. Same thing applies with this one if you wanted to put the dog on the lead. <laughs> Winnie, this is great fun, isn't it, darling? But it's not really helping. Um, so you would have to untoggle that, let it fall down, and then toggle it back up just around the neck so that the drips don't get in, so that we can put the collar on, use the collar. We show the good people? Shall we show them? No? You're too interested in the bone. That's it. Like that. But if you've got a harness and your dog loves to wear a harness, or you love your dog to wear a harness, because perhaps they're a bit of a puller on the lead, um, on a collar, or you're worried that they're going to suddenly jolt. I don't think that's helpful. Um, they're going to suddenly jolt across the road and chase a cat. Uh, a harness is a really good idea. I know many of you use harnesses for your whippets. And this is a perfect fit harness and the hole is in the same place as in our Norfolk coat and our Norwich coat. And it seems to fit well on, over a rough wear harness as well. Popular brands for whippets. <laughs> uh, I hope that you've been able to see what I'm trying to demonstrate today um, because Winnie's obviously got other things on her mind like her bone. But um, that is the Carlisle coat and that is the one if your dog wears a harness that you're going to need uh, or if you just like the toggle one, you know, with the elastic around the, around the neck and you're happy that your dog will be off the lead if it's raining, you won't mind it, and then it could be over the head. This one's also good for you um, because you don't have to use a harness with it. So I really hope that's helped. And if you want to refer back, there's another video of how to get the coat back in its little bag uh, so that you can pack it away when it stops raining. Uh, I really hope that's been helpful and I hope to see you again soon.